Pride Squad, what's good, man? It's your boy JR here, man. Back with another video on this beautiful Saturday morning, man. Just check it out. Look at that. Sun is shining. Right now, it's nice. It's nice out. It ain't super hot, but it will be. So, I'm not going to make this intro very long because we got to go it on to get to where we're going so we can put on what we're going to put on. So, I'm going to go it on and show you what we're doing today. So, since I bought this car, I have not had the rotors and the brake pads done. Obviously, you can see from the title and the thumbnail, this is what we're doing. So, in the trunk right now, I'm going on to put you up this picture right here so you can see them because I got a box up and they close up and I can't show them to you right now. But yes, we are installing new brake pads and rotors, drilled and slotted. Now, this is from a company that I have not seen many reviews or videos about at all on YouTube. I was trying to find them, but I couldn't find them. Uh, I was going to go with Brembo's, but that kit is like super expensive and... I mean, it's an RT, you know. If I had ran across one at, at the right time, I probably would have bought it. But I said, you know what, let me go on and give this a shot. And I mean, if it works, it works. If it don't, you know what I'm saying, I can change the model or whatever later on. But anyway, all right, so about to leave the house now. We're about to go and meet up with uh, KP and Keith. And we're going to ride out to Duluth to my homeboy's house, who y'all saw in the other video, Orlando, Big Time 88 YouTube channel is coming. Well, it's already there. He just got to put up some videos. So we're about to ride out. He's going to install them for us. I'm going to get the install for y'all. So I'm going to meet up with Keith, and I'm going to get back with y'all in a minute. All right? Peace. Well, I see what you mean. What? It's a goddamn haul. <laughs> you, yeah, you be coming through traffic and all that, man. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at that, boy. That boy got this setup in here. They sent that one, the front rotors, through the postal service, and then they sent the other box through UPS. I was like, come on, y'all. He was, cause he he said it's too heavy to send all together. So I was like, okay, well, whatever. They got here, so. So how much did they charge you for shipping? Was free. It was free. Oh, okay. Free shipping. If I had to pay for shipping, I'd have been pissed. They, they, I'd have had them send. I didn't even know they weren't even supposed to be until today. But that came. I ordered them like Tuesday, and they came in Wednesday. I was like, wow. Quick. Yes, sir. One day, my dude. Huh? I got them off eBay, but they got them. I think they had them. They use Amazon. Yes, sir. Fresh. Yeah. The only thing. I bet it will. I hope so. Oh yeah, they gone. I I, I told myself. Look at this, y'all. I told myself, I said, I ain't doing no more mods, no more big mods, until I get these rotors done. All them grooves. Mackish. I came over to the first time with that first box. Yeah. see you, I'm going to show how I'm we're gonna do one side first and then back in the end and do the other side. Alright. Anything mechanical can fail on you, so get you some jack sands before you do this. Uh, I need to get me some jack stands while I'm talking. Now what size is this? Like an 18 or a 10? 21. 21? Yep. Alright, so we uh... Alright. This is just to take the uh... The bracket off the hose. The caliber on. Okay. Take the whole bracket off the 
which I'm gonna take take this bottom bolt out and flip the caliber up and put the new brake shoes in. But right now I'm just taking everything off. Taking everything so off. Okay. Take the uh, road off. All right. So this right here is for taking a brake pass out. So you're gonna need one, what do they call that? Adjustable? Yeah, thumb wrench, adjustable wrench. Adjustable wrench, wrench to hold it and then... The correct name, pressure wrench. Yeah. But see that shit right there keeps spinning? Right, cause that one's gonna spin while you're trying to unscrew the, uh, the nut in the back. Old pad. They warm, I know that. They are? Hell yeah. yeah. They be lying, boy. They told me they was all right. No, they warm. Oh, warm, yeah, that's because yeah, they, yeah. Mashing on it, coming over Now, is this just uh, the thread lock and stuff? Is that just for the calibers? Holding the calibers on? Uh, I think they just do that from from the assembly line. You know, every, when they put in the car together. Yeah. They put, I think they put it on all cars. Oh, okay. But don't nobody never put it back on there. I got some, but don't nobody ever do it. Gotcha. Because this is the reason right here. See how hard I got to push yeah. down to get it off? Yeah, y'all definitely got the y'all got the tool set up, man. I, I got to get on their level with that. The tool set up, then they got the whole the, the, the whole car, uh, <laughs> the whole setup. Well, you gonna be in the house for a while? No, I'm about to move. Come on now. Yep. Back out by y'all. Oh, for real? Yeah. Hopefully. This is my Douglasville, Douglasville? Hostel area. Oh yeah, that's nice. Let's go. Hell yeah. That's See how hard I got to push? Yeah. Press that three a lot working. Now most people, oh, why are you using that gun for? <laughs> Make it easy. Right? Exactly. <laughs> now if you don't have one, that's a different story. Where your um right there? The new rope? Yeah. More smart than my heart. Let me see, I think it's front right here. Yeah, I'm about to show it to him. Uh, they go to new. Yeah. Look at this. Woo! Oh yeah, on the new road, you always want to use some brake cleaner. Some brake cleaner? Yeah, to wipe the road off because it comes with a clear film on it. Like you some... can't see it, but it's on the... Okay, it's like some oil or something? Yeah. Okay. Now they got all that shit right there on there too. Like yeah. I don't know, are they are they? They're the same size. Yeah, they're the same size. I don't know if it might be just the design or something. Maybe it's the design, I don't care. It look good to me though. Yeah, it, does. <laughs> it look a whole lot better. People know that you probably know it, but see how the way the, the, the uh, bullet holes made? Yeah. So they turn going back that way? Yeah. So you want to put it on this side of the car. 
put on the other side, and the bullet hole is gonna be going back the other way, that way. Okay. So that's yeah, so direction. Kind of it's direction. Yeah. So it's called vibration. Right. If you put them on the wrong if side. If you put them on the wrong side. Yeah. Yeah. Most people are like, oh, you're telling me some bullshit. It's warped already. Right. No, you put nah. them on the wrong. Exactly. <laughs> Since you didn't give me no new hardware, so I, clean, I mean, clean old one up. That's uh, that, that's that's they. Fault. I actually saw a review about that. They what? didn't send new clips with the brake pads. Uh, yeah. Yeah, they, they didn't send new silver clips. Ain't wrong, ain't but some companies don't even don't don't even do that. You need to get them for a while. Oh yeah. Compress the caliber again. Yeah. Yeah, it's a dual caliber compressor, but this is a single. Okay. So that's why I use the brake pad yeah. for the dual. I ain't got the one for the dual shots on it. Yeah, yeah. So I right. use the single, but I use the brake pad to put it on both of for them. Both so of it push them. both at the same time. Right, right. You know, you gotta use your brain sometimes. Okay. So. Now, if you don't do this, what'll happen? Once the piston come out while you're pushing it in, then I push it in with my thumb. Yeah. Then I do this after I do the back brake over there. Mm -hmm. Pushing both of them back in, I let you get in, pump it back up. Pump it back, yeah. So it won't push fluid out of the reservoir. Right, right. Push yeah. the fluid back to the reservoir. Uh, with the, uh, to, uh, yeah. Oh, you about to do it yourself? I use anti seeds, but you can use brake grease, shit, synthetic, same thing, damn. Same damn difference. Okay. Now my, my pads are squealing. squealing shit, yeah. Yeah, my pads are squealing like crazy before. So is that probably the reason why? What kind of brake pads you put on? They were ceramic pads. Ceramic? Yeah. But they said, well, ceramic pads do that. So I, it was like, just ride it for a while and it'll stop. Never, Never stop. stop? Never stop. See, I always put it right on these little tabs. Yeah. A lot of people don't, when they do brakes, they don't do them damn pins and they wonder why their brake caliber and shit be seizing up. You got all that heat on it all the time. Mm -hmm. No glue, no lube to it. It's gonna get hot and swell up. Look like that. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> we got uh, these gauges, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, gauge like, of course, like zero to 60, fourth mile time, mm -hmm. braking distance. I ain't never tested that braking distance. I ain't trying to. So you ain't trying? Mm -hmm. No, I'm good on that. Get a little white now, real quick, while it's while it's exposed. Mm, this is little, this right here is important. If you don't do this, your whole shit gonna fall off. <laughs> Always keep it clean. Always keep it clean. 18 for the back. Uh, 18. Okay. So is it 18 for all the bolts in the back? Huh? 18 for all the bolts on this uh on the rear? 18 to take the uh break it off. Okay. Break it both. We'll hit your car with this hammer, alright? Yeah, go on. Knock That's what I did for it. Make sure you total that mother. Hit the frame. Hit the frame when you do it. Total that bitch out. Before y'all ask, I'm, yes, I will put the part numbers down. Y'all make sure y'all go, go on YouTube. Big time. Big time 88. I'm going to have a flash across the screen right now so y'all can see. He ain't got no video up yet. But when he do. Ain't be much longer. When he do, y'all go and subscribe. I like Lil Wayne. Sorry for the wait. 
But yeah, how you want them to reach you just in case if somebody else wants you to, you know what I'm saying, do this one? Do you? Huh? All right, yeah, so y'all just drop a comment below if y'all want to get this work done. You know what I'm saying? And uh, DM me on IG, and then I'll connect y'all to them. In the meantime, make sure you know what I'm saying, go follow KP over here. Yeah, on Marvin. IG. Yeah, Marvin underscore 345 underscore Marshall. Yeah, I'm gonna have that float at the bottom of the screen for you. Of course, you know where to go find Keith at on RT Rich 88. On IG. Go and get your lights or whatever. Matter of fact, I don't wanna say the whole sound system. I don't even say the whole sound system. <laughs> we gonna let you work. You still working. He's still working on a hypothesis on that. He's still, he's still working out theories on that. So, doing the back. It's pretty much the same as doing the front, right? Yep. It's just um, use a 21 in the front and use an 18 back here. You have to take the, the bracket off that holds the caliber and okay. the brake shoe. Now for this, it was uh, 15 millimeter. 15 millimeter. Just to take the, the, the bolts out for the, uh, the brake caliber itself. Okay. Not for the bracket. Okay, I got you. I'm only gonna show you how to install for this. The front, this side, and the front, and the back on this side over here. And then I'll show y'all what it look like at the end and close it out. my boy Orlando for hooking me up on an install y'all want to get this work done just DM me on IG that's where y'all gonna be able to find them at you know what I'm saying and I'm gonna let y'all know where y'all can come to get the work done man you ain't got anything you want to say to people man no. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm your call. laughs> yeah man so anyway man that's gonna be it for this install man this your first time at the channel man go and hit that uh Hit that like button, drop a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe, man. And uh, so the next thing y'all will see before we end the video, I'm just gonna show you a little clip. It's gonna be on the inside, and I'm just gonna tell you how they feel when I'm breaking and stuff, you know what I'm saying? But other than that, y'all stay safe out here in these streets, man. It's JR, JT Productions, I'll holler on the next one. All right, peace. Initial reactions for these brakes is they feel great. Drilled and slotted, I'm gonna have part numbers and everything down there for y'all, but um, my initial reactions are, I'm real pleased with it, man. They feel really, really good. Link will be in the description if you wanna, uh, you know, get these brakes, you know what I'm saying? And uh, the brake pads and the rotors and everything. Again, shout out to Lando, Orlando for um, doing an install for me. Shout out to Keith and KP for riding out here with me, man. And uh, we just gonna make it back to our side of town now. We got another, he got another install he gotta do for the interior lights. I really appreciate y'all hitting him up for that. And uh, other than that, man, I'll be safe out in these streets, man. It's JRJRT Productions. I'll holla at y'all in the next one, man. I'm out. Peace.